Hello everybody, and welcome to the live stream. My name is Bullet. Bullet Bam! And welcome to playing some Animal Crossing. It's the first day of August, so there should be some hopefully new things going on. And I'll try not to make a complete fool of myself, even though I'm running on four hours of sleep. Which reminds me, I need to go get something to help me stay awake. Just happened, I got, a, I got an alert of some sort from Discord? Hmm. I see. Sir Wolfgang was telling me he likes my name. But, I don't know. I'm live now. Does, Sol Does Sir Wolfgang know I'm live now? Because I am. So yeah, we just did some rebranding. Changed the name to Bullet Bam. Hello, Violet. You say you had to be the first here. Bullet Beard. And you're going Bullet Beard. You would. Alright, I need to go grab a soda real quick. Because I'm like, dead on the inside. Open up a can of soda. Not something else you might have been thinking that would have been rude. No big announcements today. Wishing me a happy weekend. All right, yeah, thank you. Hey, Rick's here, saying hi with a period. Seems, is everything okay? Do you not like the rebrand? All right, let's see. That money tree needs to move or be chopped down. Please accept our sincere thanks for your continued patronage of Nook Shopping. Did I just not read it? Okay, so I already had that letter. When I see a falling star, I close my eyes and wish for... Nice try, darling. It's a secret, of course. Here's to make wishes and chasing dreams. What? Here's to making wishes and chasing dreams. I hope our wishes come true. Mommy. All right. What did I get from the bank of Nook? Oh, because it's next month. Wow, 1,500 bells. Holy crap. Amazing. What do we got in here? Mom's pen stand? Bro, no. No. That one's bad. Alright, this is just gonna go. I guess we can chop it down. Chop, chop, chop it down. I was like half expecting bees. And so is my luck with trees. Just bees. Luck with trees? Try bees. <laughs> bees. I'm not gonna say the other word. Alrighty. So, ooh, look at that thing. Let's catch it. God dang it. It's gotta be way out there. It's over here by all these flowers that I dumped on this ledge. This is infuriating. Butterfly's got the advantage of flight, and there's a cliff. Maybe chase off some other bug. I still can't catch the butterfly. There, I got it, even though I totally missed. I don't care. I got the dang purple emperor. It's about time. Okay, there's some weeds I need to pick up here. As well as a stick on the ground. Nobody wants that crap laying around. Any bees? Aw. I was hoping for bees. This is a fish? Let's try to catch it, because it might not be a fish I've caught before, even though it probably is. <clears throat> yeah. It's just one of these things. A dace. I have some space or whatever it said. I don't read it anymore because I've caught like 50 billion daces. I'm not going to bother to catch that thing either. I'm pretty sure drones sell for crap. I might be wrong about that though. Let's find out. I'm pretty sure they sell for crap, but I don't know for certain. But I, I'm pretty sure it's kind of like cicadas. Cicadas are all like 350 each. And if it's more than that, I guess I remember incorrectly. That butterfly ain't worth it either. It's just not worth the inventory space. There's another one. Exact same type. Kind of just run around looking for stuff to pick up and whatnot. Oh, do you hear that? Whoa. I've never heard that bug noise. I just chased something away I've never seen before because I was too busy looking for a balloon that I actually ran way past. There was some bug I've never seen. I just scared it off. Because it's August now. Some new stuff. Ah. <sighs> There we go. Got me a present. Oh, and some Nook Miles on top of it. 
Denim cutoffs. Yeah. It's August. Time to wear them denim cutoffs. No, I'm wearing out the I'm wearing the worn out jeans. I don't care if it's the middle of summer. Alright, uh, so the Nook Miles. Shooting down balloons and getting 400 miles for it. Don't mind if I do. While we're in the process of getting miles, I go interact with the uh, the little thingy with Bob that's in this building over here. Oh, KK's here today. It's Saturday. I forgot that. Oh. I'm so exhausted today. I got like four hours of sleep. And I'm just. Whew. I can't believe I'm actually like trying to do today. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna have to sleep for ages. Got 300 bonus miles for interacting with this thing. Get them every single day. It's nice. I always go and check in Nook shopping to see if there's anything good in special goods. Most, almost every single time with the hand cart and magazine, these two pieces of furniture here, I always have whatever they have. I have bubblegum KK as well. Sometimes there's new music. I also like looking at the wetsuits, but it's always leaf print, and I don't like the one that is with the shorts. Violet, say, I have you inspired to change your name to Violent Violet. <laughs> if, if you want to. What made you... What make what makes you say I inspired you to do that? Just because I stick with these names that have the same starting letter on both words. I like the new name though; it's good. I think Bullet Bam is a lot friendlier and reflects the way I want to appear better. So it's it's a good name for me, and I think it's better than Bullet Boops. And it's better than Bullet Bang, which are two names that I was pretty dang happy about when I came up with them. And then, for one reason or another, ended up not picking them. Because I, I originally was very excited to change my name to Bullet Boops. But I'm glad it didn't happen. At first I was kind of like, man, it, it kind of sucks that that didn't happen. But now I'm happy about it. So I'm just kind of running around getting fossils and sticks. If you see presents I don't pick up or buried things that I don't pick up, it's because those aren't actually fossils or presents that I'm unaware of. They're, they're there so that somebody else can find them. There's a bug on that tree that's all closed off up there. What's up, Boone? Hey, boss. I'm just taking a breather. Want to sit with me, Boom? Yeah, I'll sit with you. Come on. Let's chill. Just chilling out, even though he's facing the other way. Can I face him? This is odd. I'm giving him a back rub. I'm just face back to back. That way we can like lean back on one another, you know? Violet is saying, yep, that's why I inspired you. You had to turn off The Simpsons. They were doing a Lord of the Rings thing episode, and you don't want any spoilers. Good, I'm glad. I'm glad. You did it? You changed your name? It still shows it as Violet Pansy for me. I hope you remembered to hit save. All right, I've had enough of hanging with him. Oh, he got up at the same time as me. That's cool. I wasn't expecting that. All right. Oh, there's where the money tree could grow. Right next to that chair, really. It'd be interesting if I let it grow there. I don't like that, though. There's already too many trees on my island as it is. So we'll grow the money tree. Um... Probably, probably just for the actual money, though. No, chop it down, chop it down, town. Bury that money, and it should grow there, despite the fact that there's like a chair and a table right next to it. I don't think it matters, unless it does. Let's move the dang thing. By the way, say you did, darn it. It probably just takes a minute for you sending your messages twice, huh? I'm only getting them once. It's it's showing your name is Violet Pansy still though. It's a dung beetle. They're not worth catching really. I scare something else away. It was just a grasshopper around. Yeah, it's just a grasshopper. I gotta say, so far there's a lot of bugs which I'm enjoying. Hey, look, it's Coco. She's snoozing. Dude, it's kind of creepy. Let me just chill with you, Coco. How's it going? How you doing? You even awake? Are you even conscious? Are you hearing the things I'm saying, Coco? She doesn't seem like it. What's going on with you? Snurk. It's nice to take a break outside, even if I did fall asleep just now. Yeah, close your eye holes. Oh, you got up just as I was sitting down. Oh, you got a soda too? Nice. I dig that. 
There we go. Oh, never mind. Yeah. I don't know. I'm sure it'll I'm sure it'll happen with time. Maybe maybe I need to refresh my chat. This is Phil's house. We can see what Phil's up to. <clears throat> oh, he's building something. I'm glad I came and dropped by. Dude, look at his buildings thing. I want that workbench. That's a cool workbench. It's humongous, but it's cool. I'd love to have it... I don't know. I wouldn't want it in my living room. My living room's very cramped for space because I have, like... A huge kitchen and then this living room area it's all it's all kind of meshed in there and it, it's it's a nice room I like my main room in my house but there's not there's not much space for giant workbenches and stuff like that but what are you doing Phil it's making an iron wood bed the recipe came to me in a dream yeah I already know how to make one I apparently I didn't know but you know great minds think alike don't they ha <laughs> thing is I already have the recipe written down here so take it with you and share it with friends I'll I'll share it with Timmy and Tommy. How about that? Violet, you say you need to go see Phil? Why? So he can think about you again? Phil doesn't have any bugs? He doesn't have any places to put any bugs. Oh, he has a shirt. An eight ball shirt. I should give him something. Not Maybe not a bug. Do I have something cool? This thing's not bad. I'm not going to give it to him, though. I was giving people stuff I dove for, I remember. I like giving people things. Oh my god, that reminds me. I can't go in his house? I need to see if he used it, man. I gave Boone a trophy case. And if Boone did not decorate his house with that trophy case, I'm going to be angry. Violet, you say you love Phil? <laughs> He's alright. I don't mind Phil. He's asked to leave the town before, and I told him to stay. Say, so, uh, I was sad the other day because Sherb was asking if he should leave. I was like, Sherb, you're my favorite, dude. Why do you want to go? So, yeah. Ooh, that one's worth a lot. That blue one I just picked up. That shell is pretty good. It's like a thousand bells, which I don't know, might be, might not be a lot in some people's eyes. But it is, it is for me, dang it. It's real for me. Anybody ever see that episode with the guy who's really into the wrestling? You see that fish? That's a pretty big river fish right there. That might be something good. Because yeah, that's a good sized river fish for sure. Oh, it turned. I was too busy looking at the little bug that was hopping around too. Because I was like, ooh, is that something I haven't had before? But it wasn't. Ooh, bit on quick. Whoa! Soft shell turtle. I should take a shelfie? That's new. I've never caught one of these before. Oh, I didn't mean to show it off. Let me see. Where's the money? Where's the money, turtle? Huh? Give me the money. Because he's like holding it, you know? Oh, he sits in a tub. It kind of be cool to have in the house, though. I like the way he moves around and his shell kind of surfaces and, and gets sunken in a little bit more. It's pretty cool. I thought he'd be on the ground like the uh, snapping turtle. But I guess that's a snapping turtle thing. Oh, God. Got hit with a twinge of PTSD with those bridges. Bridge tabs. Bridge tabs! Yeah, it took me a while to get them situated, and then even when I thought I had them situated, I didn't. So when I made the bridges, they came out differently than I had planned, and... I don't know, they're alright. Alright, so this is my price checker. I know everything's 20% um, cheaper when you're comparing it here. Oh, uh, these bad boys worth... Ooh! So that's gotta be like... I don't know. What What minus 20% of itself equals 3,000? Because it's not 4,000. That'd be 25%. So it's like 3,800 or something around there. Is this, oh, it's only worth like 500? Not as good as I thought. What about these bad boys? Yeah, drone beetles suck. That's what I thought. Alright. <clears throat> I'm gonna keep walking around a little bit. Some weeds. I planted that tree there and... Oh, I'm supposed to make it a stump. That's what it is. I was about to say, I don't know how I feel about that, but that's right. I was gonna make it a stump. And then my axe broke on the first swing. 
So now it's the stump, and you know, I think I like having that stump there. That's nice. It needed it needed to be spruced up here a little bit. Uh, there's pretty much like nothing but a whole bunch of flowers for a while, especially before that stump got there. And I almost, I kind of wish I had one over here somewhere. Maybe I could put one here. If I could put one here, that would be ideal, but I doubt it. Because of the cliff. Violet, you caught a mosquito? Nice. It's better than getting bit by it, that's for sure. Look at Gonzo plopping a squat. Let's hang out with him. How's it going, Gonzo? Let's chill. Let me whisper in your ear. You just hold on to that secret, okay, Gonzo? Don't tell anybody. Don't tell anybody. <clears throat> I got a fossil. Gonzo, you look like you're about to pass out. What's going on, homie? Bullet, where you been? I ain't talked to you in... My word, how long has it been? Oh, apparently I've been neglecting Gonzo. <laughs> well, glad to know you're still neighborly. Stop by again soon, all right? All right, Gonzo. I used to have a boss that was voice kind of like that. His name was Gary. And he sounded kind of like this when he would talk. <laughs> it sounded like he was putting on a deeper voice than what he naturally had. Oh, I just chased something away. I couldn't even see it, which is, means that apple tree needs to move. I could try to get rid of four trees. If I can find four trees that I want to get rid of, then I'll gladly remove them. It's vibe time with BB and Gonzo. Yeah. No, I've, I've vibed with a few of my villagers so far this stream. I was vibing with Boone. I was vibing with Coco. And I just vibed with Gonzo. All right. Uh, so there was a reason I was walking this way because there was something I need to get. I was looking for trees. Yeah, that's what it was. I was looking for trees. So we found one that I could get rid of. Um, Because it's not good. It's too cramped with that apple tree there. How did I not see a bug on the apple trees? Because I was coming from above, I guess. So I'm, I'm fine with getting rid of that apple tree. It kind of cramps this area anyway. I like... What, I like the other stuff we got going on. Dude, I'm chasing away all the bugs. I'm not paying any attention. And then I'm blaming it on having too many trees. And it's like, maybe if I just paid attention, you know? Honestly, I could get rid of these two. I think I'd be okay with getting rid of these two trees right here. And then I could have something here, you know? Instead of just having trees and some grass and you can't really see anything, I could get rid of that stuff and I could have something there. Lucas, you say you missed the Coco vibe? Man. Yeah, she fell asleep. And Boone and I did the thing where you, like, sit facing away from each other so your backs are supporting one another. There's, like, the, the balance pressure going on. Okay. Uh, let's get rid of some trees, but I need some fruit. But you know what? There's fruit on the trees that I'm going to be moving, so... Ha! I know I could sell them for 200 apiece. I, I've sold a lot of fruit for money in my days, though. It's actually, I've been I've been slowly getting rid of trees on my island because I don't really care as much about making money quickly anymore. I don't want to grind in Animal Crossing these days. I used to I used to grind in this game. This is the, it's the stupidest thing you could do ever in Animal Crossing. Just play it and enjoy it. And if you're grinding, stop. Just play it however much you can enjoy it. But honestly, I used to enjoy the grind a little bit because the way I saw it was like I wanted to have a really cool Animal Crossing world and I didn't want to be super slow about getting there. Um, but I didn't really time travel to get cool stuff. I time traveled for landscaping reason, like growing trees. I did a lot of time traveling for growing trees and also picking the fruit off the trees to make money. But I didn't really skip ahead in time i would just kind of go back and forth three days because going backwards doesn't do anything so i'd go backwards three days and then forwards three days back to the current day and then backwards three days and then forward three days back to the current day and that would make it so my trees would grow as well as produce fruit but i don't i'm not about that life no more so i got a pear tree an apple tree and a cherry tree i just need to find me an orange tree i don't like or honestly any tree that i don't like and then i could just take an orange tree and remove it and then place the tree wait i don't know i don't know if you know what i'm trying to say 
I don't need to find an orange tree. I can remove any tree and then swap it with the orange tree. Okay, so I want that fish, but I also really want that. Okay, I think the fish has to go first, otherwise I'm going to scare it away. It's, again, looking like a big fish. You think it's going to be another soft-shell turtle? It bit really quickly, so it's likely. Nope, that's a catfish. I'm more of a dogfish person. Screw you, Animal Crossing. Probably shouldn't say something that crass. Oh, if it fell on the stump, that would have been so cool. I don't know if it's even possible. Once you pick up the present, though, you can't put it back down. 5,000 bells! Not bad. I'll take it. It's the whole reason I collect, um... Fossils still, is just to sell them. Because I don't have no good reason to have these fossils. So I was looking for an orange tree I don't like. Also, this is the place to grow my money tree. Because I don't know if you can tell, but there's a lot of money trees growing around here. <laughs> How much money is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven money trees are going to be grown. Times 30,000. That's 210,000 bells just like sitting here. Well, we'll get rid of this tree. We'll take the money out of it and chop her down. Dig up that stump. And then we place the new tree. This is the this is the money tree corner of my island. Where apparently I grow two hundred and ten thousand bells worth of Money bags. So, tree I don't like. Tree I don't like. I like the ones around my house. The decorative. I can't remember how much stag beetles are worth, but I'm pretty sure it's significant. They're kind of tough to catch. You gotta, you gotta really be at a distance. Oh, it's a Miyama stag. So, I don't know. I've been pretty happy with the tree placement on my island recently. This one almost feels random. Honestly, I could get rid of this tree and put it where an orange tree is. But I don't know. At the same time, it's kind of nice. There'd be a lot of open space up here. I don't know if these things are have any value, but I failed to catch it because I got too close. <clears throat> And I'm afraid to move this pear tree, because then this path is like... I, I like the way this feels like the little path next to the water. Even though that pear tree is a little bit more concealed than I would like it to be. I don't want to change it, because I really like the way this little path right here feels. I like how it's like a tight spot to get through here. What I don't like is how you can't get closer to this fountain on the corners. It has such a square hitbox for being a complete circle. The pool is the same way. Say the grind was real on the original Animal Crossing? I want to do a stream where I play the original Animal Crossing and go back and visit my town. Because I, I did it once um, a few months back, but I didn't stream it at all and I didn't play it for that long either. Because I didn't want to spoil it for myself because I realized as I was doing it that, like, dude, I would totally want to stream something like this me doing this. I don't think I've caught that thing. It's like got some pincer to it. Oh, it's a saw stag. Never mind. Yep, I've caught one of those. It's pretty congested over here, but I'm a little worried about getting rid of any of them, to be honest with you. Even though this orange tree right here would kind of be ideal to get rid of, I feel like these trees are just going to seem very random. Maybe there's nothing bad about that. It might seem very organic if the trees have a seemingly random um, growth pattern. As in there's no pattern at all. It just seems completely natural. Because I... I've planted all of these trees. Like, all of these trees I planted. There was none, there's only two trees in my town that are original... And I 
think one of them's in its original spot. Might not be at all. They might not be in their original spots at all. But I have, I have the, I have one original tree in my town as well as one original pine tree in my town. But I think those might have gotten moved. I was seeing a bleeding bullet town tour versus bullet bam town tour. Oh, you're right. Because I do need to no, know that the town flag needs to be changed. It's what needs to happen. I could do that this stream, but that'd be like the only thing I'd be doing this stream if I did. So I, don't know, I made it more open right here. There's potential for something. Some furniture of some sort. You know, I don't have any ideas right now because I don't really have anything for it. Put out the pen stand. But that's four trees. I've been trying to get rid of more and more trees because no matter how many I get rid of, the freaking dog in town hall is always dogging me, being like, yeah, we got people saying there's too many trees and they're missing their favorite TV shows. And it's like, I don't know how that's relevant. How do you get lost on a tiny little island, man? But. <sighs> Regardless of my frustrations with it, I've been getting rid of trees, even though I don't want to. And, uh, it's been going alright. I'm- I've been- I've been keeping an open mind about getting rid of the trees. You wanna see Wasteful, though? Selling these things off like that? <laughs> Make, like, no money? <laughs> alright, so let's just sell this BS. Oh, I'll keep that. I need to store it. A lot of this needs to go into my storage, that's for sure. <clears throat> that can go... We need to go see Blathers as well, no doubt. 11,000 bells, hooray! What's this chair? Folding chair, yup. Act fast if you're serious, because they're in limited supply. Alright, so I got the folding chair. I don't know, I don't know if that'll look good outside or not. I got it because I thought it might make good outdoor furniture, but I'm not really sure. Lucas saying freaking dog. Yeah, I always forget her name. I could put a chair here, at the table. Oh, that's a pen stand. Folding chair. It's definitely good for this table. Oh, it's so small. It's a very small chair. I think I would have it slightly over like that if I had the chair here. So you can still sit in it, but you can kind of sit at the table, because it's not a chair you can rotate in. Really, what should be here is stools, but I don't know. I got I'd have to get the right kind of stool so this chair basically doesn't work here because it's not a stool however I could just put it here anyway what if I had it back here because you can't really actually stand in that little corner so what if I just had it like shoved as far back as you could go over here and there's a little chair in the corner you can go sit there you're hanging out next to the nook shop. You're in the... You're in the nook of the nook shop. <clears throat> Could have a face that way, and then you gotta go around this side to get to it. So you sit like this. <laughs> I don't know, this is odd. It's kind of odd in general, but having it that way is especially odd. So I can have it like this, that's not that weird. But at the same time, nobody sits like a, sits at a table like that. There needs to be stools. That's the only... It, it needs to be stools. I can have the chair there for now. It's kind of... Whatever. The dog's name is Isabel, you believe? It is Isabel. Thank you for reminding me. Alright, so I was going to go put things away, and then I'll go talk to Blathers. I don't think KK plays music yet, even though we got Ribbit and... Or, er, uh, Ribot. Sorry, not Ribbit. Ribot. Yo, how are you? I want to chat. Don't mind me. I'm just keeping the peace on Voletaria. I try to do a few patrol dog jogs every day. <laughs> I don't know how to do a fuchsia voice. <laughs> she's like a she's like a rocker chihuahua. So I don't know. How do you how do you do a rocker chihuahua voice? Because I wanted I was gonna do a lady voice, you know, but it's gonna be way too soft. I can't I can't do a tough girl voice. That's not something I'm capable of doing. Like, Yo, bullet, how you doing, precious? Just make her sound like she's been smoking for forty years. 
<laughs> I'm not gonna do that. I already have too many smokers voices. Not smoker voices, but ones that are gravelly like that. Uh Blather's voice is gravelly. I got Flick's voice is is rough like that. What's the latest, Fuchsia? Can't decide what I want to do next. Do I go bug catching, fishing, maybe gardening? Ah, too many choices. BB's Peepy says, Who this guy? It's me, BB. What you talking about? New phone, who dis? Yeah. New name, who dis? Alright, so why was I coming in here? Well, I really didn't have a good reason, but Isabel! She's gonna tell me, you have a four star town, because there's not enough furniture, even though you put furniture everywhere. And also, you have too many trees, even though I removed, like, 30 of them. Four star rating. This is a good island, filled with good feet that know the value of a good rug. Visitations are pleasant. What a nice, in, whatever you said, excerpt? Excerpt. Well, there you have it. According to recent feedback, the general sentiment is that this island lacks appealing scenery. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I, I'm sorry. You do something about it, Isabel. You decorate the island. You spend all your bells at the Nook shop, okay? Okay? <sighs> Oh. Use the island to decorate with items I've created. I gotta put more I gotta put more pieces out that I created, is that what it is? Too many items lying around cluttering up the islands. What are you talking about? I pick up all the sticks. It's the it's the presents. They don't like the presents. You're not kidding me, man. I got presents laying around for my guests and people in my town. Like, eh. went out to the beach and there was a present, and I'm like, whatever. All right, I'm not supposed to be this aggressive. Bullet Bam's supposed to be nicer. <laughs> it's it's because I'm cranky. All right, the four hours of sleep has got me being a cranky boy, and I just want to have good evals. She did not say that I had too many trees, so my trees are finally acceptable. I do not have to remove any more trees. Which makes me a happy boy. Um, however, they're complaining about the presents I leave lying about. I think they're nice. I think they're dandy. And everybody's like, me, 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 me. And I'm like, shut up, fat boy. <laughs> um, sorry. <laughs> Getting a little sidetracked there. I, I'll pick this one up. I like that present being placed there, but whatever. I'll pick that one up. What do we got here? A mobile. Oh, it has to hang on the wall? Or if you're British, you might say mobile. Ooh, that butterfly is worth a thousand bells. Give me that outdoorsy net. Don't trample the flowers. Get that butterfly. Hey, look at that. There's a bottle right on the beach. Paper guy butterfly. Thank you. Thank you very much. Do you know who that was? Uh, I can't remember you, Flamingo's name. Do you know who whose grave is that? Because I've been wondering. Whoa, I didn't mean to swat the flowers. Oh, Flora, that's your name, that's right. Oh my gosh, it's Bullet. Here's a gift? No. Let's talk. I'm just walking around the island. You know, get my face out there, building my brand, being famous. Yeah, nothing like being on an island where there's nine other residents. I guess if you count the people who run the shops, like blathers and stuff, you could say at most 15. <clears throat> Whose house is this? I can't remember. I think, I want to say it's Zuck's house, but I don't think so. Whose house is this? Is it Gonzo's house? Oh, it's Coco's house. What up, Coco? I gave her something. I don't remember what it is. She totally didn't use it, though. But that's okay. Her house is, like, outdoorsy, I guess? It doesn't really make any sense, because she used to have, um, in previous Animal Crossing games, she had gyroids in her house. But there are no more gyroids. They don't, they don't exist in this game as furniture. The only gyroid I've ever seen in this game is that one who, when you build bridges, there's that gyroid. Welcome to my home, doyoing. Or how should I do it? Welcome to my home, Doyoing. <laughs> What's the latest, Coco? 
How's that friend of yours from Ganja Isle doing? You and Violet get along well, Doyoing. Yeah, I go Doyoing, thinking about Violet too. She's got a popsicle? Oh. I've never seen them actually consume the popsicle. Yeah, Isabel. Yeah, Isabel doesn't like my island, my item sitting around the island. Okay, it's not like I dropped trash over here. There's really not that many items sitting around. It's the presence, though. I know it is. That's why it said there's so there's too many items sitting around the islands because I got presents stashed. And that's the thing. They cool land. They they land in cool spots, and then I leave them there for somebody to make a happy discovery upon. I can't tell if this fish looks big or not, so I'm gonna catch it. Ooh, yeesh. Everything is a quick biter these days. Just like your mom. What? I gave her springing, but she totally didn't use it. Why was that so comedic? I gave her something, I said. I gave her something, but she totally didn't use it. And... Now I get why you're... I don't know. Why would you, why'd you call me by that name? I don't appreciate that. Moving away from that? You're gonna... You're gonna... Sink the claws of the past into my flesh in the middle of my stream and I'm gonna act super dramatic about it? <laughs> it's another one of these turtles! I caught a soft shell turtle. I should take a shelfie. Alright, I need to give that to somebody. Should I give that to Coco? Should I just sell it? <laughs> it's worth like it's worth like at least thirty five hundred. My guess is three thousand seven hundred and fifty. All right. I never went and talked to Blathers, nor did I ever go stash things in my house, and I was supposed to do both. But there's all these big fish in the creeks and ponds. <clears throat> I got I got too fidgety. <clears throat> I know what I said, Violet. I know. I real I, I caught on to why you were going, wow. <laughs> and it's doyoing, okay, get it right. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Now we got like all the fossils that spawned on my island today. Let's just go oh, let's go talk to Blathers about it. Skull emoji. <laughs> I killed Violet, guys. Ooh, that fish has got balls. It didn't run away from me, man. Did you see that? Stayed there, even though I was sprinting past. Or are you no fish at all? Are you another turtle? Yeesh, man, they bite so quick. <laughs> Dude, these turtles are everywhere right now. They're everywhere right now. It's just like, what do we got in here? Oh, a turtle. What do we got in here? Oh, a turtle. Look, an eagle. Sorry. Probably not funny at all saying look an eagle out of nowhere. Um, it was from a Slim Jim commercial where one of the three stooges was fighting a bear over a Slim Jim. <laughs> he got the bear to turn around and look. He said, look, an eagle. And the bear's like, oh. <laughs> it's stupid, but it's funny. All right. So, blathers. I got some fossils for you to assess. Check it out. I got however many this is. Six? I thought only five spawned on my island today, but I got six. Check that out. All right. They already have all those fossils. And now I got donations for you, Blathers. Yeah. I got this soft-shelled turtle. Look at this. Look at this bad boy. Hoo-hoo. Why, this is a soft-shelled turtle. Now, might I interest you in a few fascinating facts about your soft-shelled turtle? Yes, please tell me. Wonderful. I would love nothing more. The soft-shelled turtle is not one to shy away from biting when provoked. In addition to its powerful bite, this little critter has the ability to breathe both above and below water. It has an unusually long neck, which it uses for both breathing and biting. Come to think of it, how did you manage to avoid being bitten? Well, it's a fearsome critter, but just look at that face! Rather silly, what? 
And there you have it. Fascinating stuff, no? Rest assured, all donations are displayed in a timely manner. You have my gratitude. Might I help you with anything else? Got another donation for you, Blathers. Marvelous. What would you like to donate? Got this Arapaima for you, Blathers. Hootie hoo. This must be an Arapaima. Now, might I interest you in your... Uh, <clears throat> Let me try that one again. Now, might I interest you in a few fascinating facts about your Arapaima? Yeah, please tell me, Blathers. Wonderful, I would love nothing more. The stately Arapaima is quite large. Indeed, it is among the largest freshwater fish there are. Furthermore, these fascinating fish make quite the family unit. That is to say, male Arapaimas protect their young by holding them gently in their mouths. Meanwhile, female Arapaima swim circles around these full-mouthed fathers, fending off predators. It simply goes to show that cold-blooded creatures can be heartwarming, too. And there you have it. Fascinating stuff, no? Alright, that's that. Thank you, Blathers. You were very helpful. Might I help you with anything else? No, I'm fine. Jolly good. Please enjoy the rest of your visit. Alright, I actually wasn't gonna hang out, Blathers. I was just gonna, I was just gonna take off. Check it out, I got Nook Miles for assessing files. Or, er, assessing fossils. I got Nook Miles. BB's a classy man with classy quotes. Uh huh. What if BB bans the unspoken name in the chat? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna make it so you can't say bleeding in my chat. Hey, you wanna get another turtle? What you got? Oh, it might not be a turtle. What we got? Another catfish? Is it another catfish? Oh, what is this bad boy? It's a gar, isn't it? That's a gar. We gotta go right back to Blathers. I caught a gar. Yar, it's a gar. Har, har. I love it. Alright, right back to Blathers with that gar. Didn't think I'd find one of those in a pond. That thing was like just as long as that pond was wide. Alright, here we are. Blathers. Might there be something with which I can assist you? Make a donation for you, Blathers. Yeah, already. I found something new already. Marvelous. What would you like to donate? Got this gar for you. Here you go. Hoo, woohoo! This is undoubtedly a gar. Now, might I interest you in a few fascinating facts about your gar? Yeah, please tell me, Blathers. Wonderful. I would love nothing more. Hoo-hoo, so you have snagged gar. Did you know this beastly fish can grow up to nine feet long? Indeed, the gar is a remnant of times long past, a living fossil, if you will. It not only has sharp teeth and armor-like scales, it has the ability to take breaths of air as well. Ah, to look upon this unusual fish is to get a glimpse of our prehistoric past. And there you have it. Fascinating stuff, no? That's rude. You've been calling that since five ever. <laughs> you can't call me that anymore. Lucas saying dummy thick. Dude, my thigh's been getting dummy thick from walking to work. So weird. Put on these jeans that I stopped wearing because they were like a little bit skinnier than I like. And I ran out of clean pants to wear today, so I put these ones on. And they're so freaking tight. Oh my god, they're so tight. <laughs> Alright, let's wear the wetsuit because there's something I can catch. Let me just jump right on top of that fish. What do we got here? What is this? Show yourself. Come back here. I will not rest until you are in my hands. Don't think I won't get you. Yeah, I got you before I ran out of breath. That's right. That thing went fast, man. That mantis shrimp. Mantis amazing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. They updated the game and now you can change the camera angle while you're swimming. You used to not be able to do that. But they, they updated it and made it so you can now. Nice, I'm happy. Hey, like there's something else out there. Cause that sucks, not being able to change the camera while swimming was like this, it felt like this stupid thing that they overlooked. So I'm glad they patched it. That needed to get patched, man. I didn't even realize that's what the last uh, update was. I knew they made an update, but I didn't know what for. I'm just gonna get back out of the water. I'm not the biggest fan of swimming. 
Even though now that it's August, I should probably do a little bit more of it. There's probably something new out there for me. And I'm sure there was things that I didn't catch before. Because I never, I haven't done all that much swimming yet. I kind of wish there was more to do out there. It's low-key boring. Alright. Uh, so, to get my suit off, I need to go here. I need to remove the suit. And I need to place the suit where suits go. Right there. Okay. Let's see what the Able Sisters got for me today. Yay! Yes, sir. I'm a little confused. I'm not sure what... <laughs> I'm not sure what the cheering is. <laughs> I'm just going to play my game. I know what you're thinking. Why is Sable here working every Saturday? I actually get the most done on Saturdays. I feel... I like feeling productive when everyone else is resting. Gosh, workaholic, Sable? And Papa always told me, stitching overtime can save your spines. Okay. Yes, the fable. The, fi the, the, the fitting room. Mabel is what I'm trying to say. Hey, look, it's the shirt I'm wearing. Gillette in shirt. I almost don't mind the white and blue. Surprisingly. Slacks. Probably nothing here that I want. I'm just checking. Because why wouldn't I? I can get a beak. Pretty sure I've seen this before and I opted not to. Oh god, it's even creepier with the facial hair, because it gives me like mutton chops when I don't have when I don't have the actual beard and it just shows this. They're like they're like mutton chops, I swear. It's like it almost looks like a chin strappy type button shop thing. It's very strange. The facial hair that I have without the beard piece. All right, yeah, see, I don't want, I don't want none of that jazz. Nothing, caught my eye, sorry, Mabel. Thanks, please come again. I'm sure I will, it's like the only clothing shop in town. It'd be very strange for me not to come back. All righty, oh, I scared something away, but I'm pretty sure it was up on the second floor, so there's nothing I could have done about it anyway. What size was that fish that I just walked past? See, that's a good sized fish. Do you think it's another turtle? I wouldn't be surprised. I've been catching tons of turtles right now. Oh, I just, I was so over, I was so over uh, prepared. Way over prepared to the point where I just went for it instantly. These two are literally just sitting here waiting for him, waiting for him to start his little concert. You know what? I like that present there a lot. I'm not going to pick that one up. That one's like right at the entrance of my town, and I think it's very beautiful. So I'm going to let that stay there. Not beautiful, but I think it's perfectly placed. And I like this one over here by my house as well. However, I think there's two by my house, isn't there? There's one stashed back here. It's really stashed. It's not just this pan flute, even though honestly the pan flute counts as an item just sitting there as well. And I wonder if the items that are sitting on top of the tables count as items just sitting there. I swear to god there was a present over here. Maybe I picked it up. Oh, nope, there it is. See that? That one's stashed so well. And yeah, nobody's even gonna find that one. Toolbox. Weak. That's what I get is a toolbox. Forgot that I had too many items around my island. Maybe this coconut's not helping either. Oh, look at that. It's one of those eels. Catch one of those bad boys. Don't mind if I do. Come at me. Ooh, aggressive son of a gun. An eel. Can it tie itself in a bow? And look, there's a present over here. That one's in a cool spot too. Ah, see, I like the presents. I like leaving them in spots like this. But I don't want to have bad island evals, so I'll pick them up. No, that bugs the crap out of me. Mini cactus set. Mini cactus set. I don't know if I've seen this set. I may have. I may have seen this set, but I'm not sure. There's like three butterflies in this shot there. One of them was Paper Kite Butterfly, it looks like. Oh no, even better, it's an Emperor. At least I think it's better. Paper Kite are only worth a thousand. Emperor, I think, is like three thousand. There we go, I caught it. The other two aren't worth all that much. <clears throat> Alright, I still have yet to go in my house and put away things that I don't need to be carrying. 
Luke would say that it's not a good look. What, the duck bill? You don't think me having a duck bill is a good look? Oh, I love the music in this room. It's like the original Animal Crossing music. It makes me so freaking nostalgic, man. Okay. Uh, so... I came in here to put away things such as this wood. And these sticks, even though I'm going to pick up more sticks, so it feels kind of stupid. What do we got in the message bottle? I never read those messages. Chocolate, herringbone, wall? What in the world does that look like, I wonder? Oh, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. Hmm. Might look good somewhere. I could try to make it just to test it out on my around rooms in my house. I, maybe my basement might look... Oh, no. My basement's got all those monitors. It's my uh, <coughs> surveillance, surveillance room. Okay, and this can hang on the wall. But I probably don't need a mobile nowhere in my house. I just want to see it, you know? I just, yeah, I don't need that. I just wanted to see it. Okay. So let's get rid of that by pressing the down directional button and then pressing start. And then... Give me that thing. Problem is it just stored it in my inventory. Or stored it in my storage. Not my inventory. So let's make sure we go in there and get it. Because I don't want to leave that thing in there. There's probably some stuff I can get rid of. I don't know, this study desk I don't need... Antique console table, I don't need. Antique mini table. I don't know, would these look good out here? Like, if I had this antique console table instead of that wooden low table, would it look good? Only one way to find out, right? I wish it was darker in color. That's the only thing, really. Oh, god dang it. Why does this game always gotta be difficult like this? At least there's this mode. I'm, I really like that this thing, this mode exists. Okay, so... It's like covering up the security panel thing, though. So I need to move that up. It'll make more sense to have that poking out above the table. Okay. Oop. I need to put things on that table. Yeah, that's the way I wanted it to be facing drawers this way, even though it's not like it opens. Okay. And I had a wooden low table um, recipe on top of the wooden low table. That kind of cracks me up. Let's put the lamp back on there. I like that, man. I almost like it clear. Without anything on there. It's like a shame to put something there, even. So maybe I just won't. I feel like I have so much stuff, though. Okay, what else I got hanging around my inventory? Yeah, this antique mini table. I feel like I have a use for that. I do not have a use for gas range. Or the standing toilet. Or this throwback dino screen. I'm crashing your screen. Crashing my stream? Yeah. Okay, that's fine. You didn't want to bring a folding chair or anything? Ow! It's breaking. Yeah, it sounded painful. <laughs> no, lawn... right, I think I, I think I have a lawn chair just like this already outside. Except the light does nothing with this. Look at that. Oh, your hair getting chroma keyed out because it's green. Why couldn't you have had a different color screen? <laughs> Because it's called a green screen. What do you mean, why couldn't I have a different color screen? Well, I don't like it. Look at what it does to me. <laughs> it makes me you're, look bald. You're the one that dyed your hair that color, so... I wanted to go green. I don't, Dang it. I don't want to hear you blaming me. I'm blaming you. When you're the one that dyed your hair green. I'm blaming you. That ain't right, man. It is right. That ain't right, man. It is right. Now, do you hear the words coming out of my mouth? That ain't right, man. It really is right, though. Man, woman. If we're gonna do that. Oh. Wow. Just, yeah. Just, just. Yeah. Whatever that word is with masculate in it. Put that in your <laughs> pipe and bubble it. 
<laughs> really? Trying to make it semi kid friendly as Thank I was you. talking. Thank you. I appreciate. I appreciate. It. I appreciate your hard. efforts. It was hard to do. I don't know. I guess that little table's all right. I can dig that little table. It's not bad. I don't think I want to have two of them. I actually like that there's variety of table, and that square one looks good in between the uh, in between the fridge and the counter. But having the circle one on the end, I think that's nice. I think that's nice. You've been catching some good stuff, man. I'm like jealous. Dude, I caught I caught so many turtles. I know, the three turtles. I saw. The three turtles I caught. That's like twelve thousand bells on these. I think it's I think it's closer to eleven thousand. I'm not quite sure how much they actually are yet. Fudge. Well, bam, girl. Cause my name's Bullet Bam. Just thinking about that at work today. I feel like saying bam. <laughs> Don't do it, man. Don't do it. Why not? <laughs> What's up? What's up, Chris? Why are you saying boom? Babies, baby. What up? <laughs> it's his name. I can say it. Yeah, I know. Yeah. It's actually BB's big pee pee. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. BB's big pee pee. Get it right. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> Don't you see that? <laughs> so so much crap. I almost want to keep one to give to a. Do it. I want to give it to a it. Uh, villager. Do it. Oh, I'm not selling mom's pen stand. This better not be a fake. There's a shark right there. Ooh, I hope you catch a shark, and yeah, I hope it's not a. Uh, what are they called? A sucker no! fish. <laughs> Did I make you miss it? Yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> you don't need to cry. It'll be okay. You'll find another one. I promise you. I've only found three. And you've only found three. Yes. You need to go around the coastline some more then. Do you think I haven't been going around the coastline? <laughs> you think I don't circle the coastline? You I circled the coastline you, for 20 minutes. Do you scare away the fish that aren't? the ones you want to catch? No, I catch them. Oh, you just catch all the fish? That's yeah. fine, too. Yeah, if, it's either catch them all or look for specific ones, but you don't want to, if you're looking for specific ones, you don't want to just walk away from them. Like that, like that one I just did. I walk away from fish all the time. I but, ain't no noob, Chris. But I don't really care that much. Sir? <laughs> wow. Just calling her a noob. This is mean. He's super mean. Chris is mean to me. The only time he helps me is when he's trying to give me steak tips. Steak? Yeah. Because, you know, I didn't like the steak that oh. I cooked last I, night. I liked it. I had it last night, and then I had it a little bit of it for lunch today at work. I'm glad you liked it. I don't know. Yeah. It was too vinegary. I don't like vinegar. I was gonna... It had three separate vinegars that you needed in it. Yeah, that was that's three a Three separate ones. But I'm I, didn't, like, I didn't taste vinegar when I was eating it, the steak. Oh, no. Look at all my neighbors right here. I already talked to a lot of them today. I didn't talk to Nan yet. Great to see you, bullet kid. I not anybody on my island today. No one. They've all tried. I don't know if I ever gave Nan any bugs or anything. Let's chat, Nan. I'm struggling to come up with a last minute dinner plan, kid. Well, I do have this turtle. Right. Jesus. I'm just kidding. Is that a turtle or is that the mayor? Because there used to be a mayor in the first Animal Crossing named Tortimer. I, I guess got, he was a tortoise. I got a bad... Not a bad thing, but... Not the most inappropriate. Just don't. It's a good one. No, just don't. No, just don't, please. Hey, I caught a red snapper. Three thousand bells, please. Maybe else Shit. is a red snapper. That was pretty snappy. <gasps> Take that back. <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> Only I'm allowed to talk oh, bad about Oh, I've my never mother. seen that bug before. I just scared it off of a palm tree. It was small and in grayish blue in color. You ready? What? Lull. I'm just gonna lull at my pain. Mm -hmm. Such a heartless person. I lull at everybody. How could you be so heartless? <laughs> I don't even like that song. I that is like one of the only Kanye West songs that I really like. Oh, I swung and too I don't early. I not listen to it that much. No wait, no, it's not heartless. I don't like that one. It's stronger. I like stronger. Oh. Nah, 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 they don't kill me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, hear that? You don't even want to hear me sing. Sing you like it. I didn't say I like it. I'm a beautiful singer. That's Why you gotta do me you don't, dirty? You can't sing a Kanye West song, though, okay? I'm a beautiful like. rapper. 
I'm not catching like any fish and literally just grabbing a bunch of shells. I'm the best Animal Crossing player. Hey man, that's the beauty of Animal Crossing. You don't even have to be good at it. Yeah. I don't know. It helps and I just, you are though. There's just certain things I don't care about anymore. I see all the little fish and I'm like, okay, it's just gonna be a bunch of clownfish and seahorses. Like, I don't need that. Ooh, this is the same spot where I got my tire. I have a rock specially oh. for my boots and the tires that I find. You're, you're gonna get- It's called dumpster rock. You're gonna get the prompt that I just got from Isabel, which is there's too many items laying around your island. Cause I had a bunch of presents laying all over, like hidden spots, cause they just happened to land in cool spots and I'd mm -hmm. leave them there. Whoa, I just got 30,000 bells out of this one. Nice. Yeah. College dropped. Oh, college drop. Oh, collage dropout is the best Kanye West album. Fight me. I don't know. I don't listen to Kanye. I, I wouldn't yeah, be able to. I don't know a single album name. I got nothing. I, 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 that's how it is for most artists for me, though. Because, no. I don't know. It's uh, rappers? Nah, man, I can't do rappers. Except Eminem, but even then, I don't know all of his albums. I only like a certain few songs off of each album. Now, hit me up with some uh, all post rock. What am I trying to say? What music I don't am know. I into? Is it metal? I don't even consider my music metal. I don't... Post-hardcore... Mu music's too nonsense for me. I listen to stuff, it sounds good, sometimes it doesn't, and then I don't listen to it. I could go on and on about my music, though. It's like... I know I all the know. albums. Art, art is too... all over the place for me. It's like, <gasps> no, man, we're not this, we're that. <sighs> Look at all these fishies I've been catching. I'm, ner I'm bad about that one. You're mad about me catching Arapaima? Yeah. <laughs> I'm jealous. You gave it to Blathers. But I didn't get this guy. I got that guy. You didn't get the saw shark. You've gotten the sucker fish. Yep, and I got the saw, the hammerhead, and the great white. Yee. I caught a guard. Did you see that? What are those two? Oh, those are those ones. Marijuana and the oh, Dorado. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. See, that's why I've been fishing in the in the um, rivers, but I never get the cool stuff. See, my town's, do. like, set up perfectly for it, because I didn't even plan this, but I used to, like, my islands where you could just go around it like crazy, and you could just get all your ocean fish, like, yeah. all over. But the way it's set up on this island is you go, ocean, river, ocean, <laughs> River. So I end up getting like a nice mix. I can dig it. Yeah. See, my, my, I chose the river that just like straight up goes all the way through it. Oh, well, I mean, I changed my river a lot. Oh, yeah, I figured you did. Yeah. You did a lot of stuff to your island. Because it, um. Shoot, I don't even remember. This used to be an island. Where the land I'm walking in right now, the river used to start to wrap around it around here and it made like a pretty decent sized island i moved the island down to here and i made it way smaller I put a bunch of bridges on it because <laughs> you know as long as my bridges love me <laughs> okay but yeah i'm kind of running out of stuff to do in the game so i'm gonna sell my stuff and then bank my money and that's probably gonna be that Violet and I got stuff to do, and we want to finish watching the second Lord of the Rings, because she's never seen them before, and I haven't seen them in, like, 15 years, so I'm super nostalgic watching them, and it's, it's exciting, and I had Lord of the Rings music stuck in my head for, like, all day at work today. And I don't know why. Because, <laughs> man, taking out the garbage, it's just like... Man, I had to turn off The Simpsons, though. They just start. It started getting progressive, like after the fact of what we already watched. Yeah. Like, nope, nope, turn it Vi off. Turn Violet it off. was watching off. The Simpsons, and then a uh, a Lord of the Rings episode came on, and she had to shut it off so that it, she wouldn't spoil the movie for herself. I did good today. I made the, all those one hundred sixty-six thousand bells. I started at zero. Oh my gosh, my hair was like the color of the grass. And it's funny because it kind of is like, <laughs> in real life. Oh, so it looks kind of correct? It looks really correct. <laughs> See, don't go back to it. Just walking on the grass. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> See? That's that's what her hair looks like normally. It does. That's, yep. Yeah. <laughs> Alrighty. So I'm going over here to deposit my bells. 
That's a wrap. First stream of Bullet Bam. Yeah! No, I really wish I could have the exclamation point here on DLive. Oh, well. I'm just really happy that I'm DLive.TV or DLive slash Bullet Bam, and that got changed. It didn't stick with the old URL. Thank goodness. However, I think I accidentally changed my name to having no capitals, and you can't change it for a month. So I'm stuck with no capitals for a month, I'm pretty sure. Smart. Let me see. Let me see. I'm going I'm to type in the chat. Do I have capitals in my name? Oh, it shows it there, so I do have capitals. Bullet Bam. Check, check. One, two, three. Check, 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 check. It's kind of hard to see what my logo is, but it was tougher before. No one could really see it bleeding. It's just, I feel like when people look at that, they're not going to look at it and think, Bullet Bam. They're going to think just bam. bam. But it's very hard to get Bullet Bam in a super small image and have it be recognizable as what the heck it is at all, you know? All right, so. Darn these pufferfish. Yeah, I'm doing really good on my, um, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Censorship. Yeah, no, you are doing good. I appreciate yeah. it a lot. I appreciate it a whole lot. All right, so we're up to 32, or 3.2 million bells. I'm trying to get up to 3.5, and then I'm going to pay off my house, leaving me with 1 million left over in case I come across that crown that the Able Sisters have sometimes that I really want, and the one time I saw it, I did not have enough bells for it. So... Still getting there. Still working towards paying off the house. I have all the expansions, but it's not paid off yet. Alrighty. But indeed, like Lucas said, that's a wrap. Thank you so much for watching this live stream. It's been fun. Don't. Okay, bye. Yep, bye. <laughs> Don't forget, I'm Bullet Bam, and this is Violent Violet. I'm doing a name change too. Yeah, some rebranding going on with Violet too. Not really. My my picture and everything will stay the same, but. Now it's just more accurate. I ain't no pansy. Okay, bye. Okay, bye.